Hi everyone, my name is David and this is another answer video and the question is uh, on a video that I did on how to permanently ban subtitles to a video movie using subtitles using subtitle edit with your preferred font and the question is how do you position the subtitles by default the position right is right at the bottom I just need to position it a couple of pixels slightly higher so let's go back into subtitle edit uh, for another answer video uh, if you look at this, the subtitles are usually down here by default. Uh, if you right click on just a single line, you can see the alignment and the alignment by default is bottom center. There are other forms of alignment that are available. But now if you click on middle center, this pushes this to the center, which is not the ideal for this scenario or answering this question, because clearly that's not what uh, is desired in this effect. And I've always recommended if the guys at Subtitle Edit can see this, they just have an extra section here where we can actually uh, set the X and Y axis based on the section where we're at. Let's say we have, uh, we at the bottom actually, this alignment of bottom center. We have like the X and Y axis at this edge of this particular alignment box that we can adjust the way we want. Now, since this is not available, for uh, manipulation and use right here, the first thing you need to do, you need to change the format of the subtitle. We're using an SRT subtitle style here. So uh, it's limited in uh, the ways you can manipulate it. So the first thing, click on this, the format drop down, and then select on advanced substation alpha or dot .ass subtitle style, just click on that. The next thing you need to do, since you want to burn in your subtitles to your video, you'll need to make sure that you make like an edit, uh, let's say to the style. The default I believe has a font of about 50, uh, but uh, you can actually go to subtitle styles and then just uh, bring it, let's say to about 40 and then click on apply, click okay. And it makes the subtitles a little bit smaller for your liking. You can actually also add an opaque box behind that, reduce like the alpha transparency here click OK, apply, OK. Now, we've done a couple of things, change the subtitle format to a format that allows positioning or allows you to manipulate the positioning. So the next thing, we want to change the positioning for all these subtitles. Let's say, assume it's this, to just bump that a little bit higher. Just press on Control A to select all the subtitle lines, then right click. Once you right click, go to ASSA tools, and then you'll see the option to set position. If you click on that, you'll see uh, what happens is that whatever position you want to set is actually going uh, to be followed uh, by your mouse. So you can clearly see where you want your subtitles to be. But it would be awesome to actually know if this is the center or where this particular subtitle uh, is actually going to be placed. But let's assume this is where this initial subtitle was or that is the initial subtitle section then you can bump it up let's say to somewhere like there you can just click there and it locks in to place it gives you the text position as 60, 679 uh, 651 that is the x and the y axis so we can just move this on the side and we can see our subtitles were a little bit lower here but now in the new position they're a little bit higher the only thing that remains is for you to ensure that all the selected lines, uh, that is what the changes are actually going to be applied. And then you click OK. Once you do that, the subtitle position is adjusted. And if you can actually now see there's a new code tag here for the positioning. And this is how uh, you can actually now cha make changes to this positioning from here based on what you want each subtitle to have. So I believe I've answered that question on how you can actually position the subtitles uh, using uh, uh, just bump it up a little bit higher but I wish it was simpler uh, in that if you just right click on a subtitle line or a bunch of them you can actually pull up the alignment with X and Y axis that uh, can actually show you in real time what you're doing and the sections where the changes are occurring if they are at the center or anything of that sort so I hope this video answers your question and thank you so much for asking this question until next time stay safe and never stop learning